Hola YouTube, my name is Ricardo and I'm a mobile addict. We are at the Adept brand headquarters in Holland, really close to Amsterdam. I don't really know the name of this place. What is it? It's The Hague. It's close to Rotterdam actually. It's in Holland. <laughs> Come on. Holland. <laughs> and today we are going to talk about the latest aggressive skating product. The Levy skate? Yeah, Levy van Rijn. Okay. It's our newest pro skater actually. Okay. So yeah, Levy has been skating for us for quite a while, uh, ever since he was like, I think, 13 or 14 years. And uh, yeah, he's been growing within the brand and uh, he lives very close to us. So we, he was always our test mule. He would test every skate that we made. And uh, yeah, so basically I think it was time for him to get his own pro skate. That's cool. He's 17 now. Uh, I think he's 19 already. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Still he, looks like to me. <laughs> he's, he's still really young. And he just finished up uh, with a, a double section in the Adept movie. So, yeah, I think it was the right time to produce uh, a pro skate for him. Okay, so let's talk about the product specifically. What's special about this product? First, like, by the looks, <coughs> it looks like an Adept skate, which is already different from the rest of the skates in the market yeah it is, but it is, as, yeah. What, what in general what does adapt as different from the other skate and what does these have different from the previous versions yeah so basically the adapt what it made what makes it different than any other skate on the market is the way the cuffs works uh, inside so basically it has uh, this is the the shell used in the skate so it's basically a one-piece construction um, which we went with, uh, we developed this like uh, seven, eight years ago, basically. Um, but it's not all the same material, that's something that I found interesting about yeah, it. Yeah, it is a, a mixture of uh, different uh, materials. So over the years, uh, we listened to the, the skaters, we, we listened to the, our customers, what did they want, what did Levy, for example, want. So basically, uh, the Levy skate has uh, more flex to it than the other skates. So basically, as I can show here this is crazy it this is, is kind of like you look at it it looks like carbon what's the material is it uh, this is diolan diolan okay, so, yeah diolan is a military grade fiber so it's uh, eight times stronger than kevlar and yeah it's almost uh, indestructible basically under pressure even so uh, in short carbon is really stiff so if you use it in the right places it, it works perfect um, but Yolen can withstand every uh, pressure from every side, basically. basically. You try to have the skate supportive where it needs, so yeah, underneath so the bottom. it's supportive and it's yeah. protective. Yeah. And then when you want some flex, you put that material there on yeah. Yolen. Indeed. And the but Yolen. there's... Wait. What is this? Yeah. Is it broken? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, basically what, what a lot of people don't know, uh, basically when we created the six mount, which is, as you can see on the inside, it has six bolts. Um, we actually made the system so that you can adjust the sole plate to the boot. So basically if your foot goes a bit more to the uh, inside, you can actually adjust it and make it the right position for you. So it's just like this. <coughs> yeah. Then you bolt it down and it sits uh, perfect so it doesn't shift anymore. But it also goes front and back. Yeah, that's front and back is to optimize the perfect space actually uh, for the frame. So uh, the other thing it does, for example, if you want to do more top sides, you can actually put it more, your boots more. No to way, you side. got the shitty boots. <laughs> <laughs> you can shift the boots to <laughs> the other side. You can shift the boots <clears throat> yeah. to the other side. Yeah. Um, but in the end, we always set them up. When you buy them, we set them up standard. We bolt them down and it's an easy thing you can do at home. You can just release the bolts and then push them a bit to the, oh, to the side. Here can you, it goes can you really also put it to the negative <coughs> side? You yeah, can. you can also put it to the negative side. Here we, it's really easy because it's a sample. Obviously. On the real skates, there is actually a layer of uh, sort of glue <coughs> that when you heat it up, you can shift it. And you, there's going to be leather in between plastics. And uh, you know, there's no leather, there's like an actual sort of foam that absorbs uh, impact. And that makes the skate also more like... And, uh, yes, this and the uh, cork inside of the shell. Ah, oh, you have cork inside yeah, the shell? Yeah, there is uh, a metal piece inside. Okay, so here? There's, uh, yeah, you can't see it, but there is a metal piece inside uh, to optimize the, the holes of the frame. So they're always exactly the same. And then around the metal piece there is cork. And that is between, it's like a sandwich, between the carbon, the diolin, 
there is this cork and it absorbs every uh, shock basically it's a natural shock absorber yeah yeah and it also de-stresses like everything from the carbon and the resin so it doesn't okay. damage in case you didn't understand or in case i didn't say before this scale <laughs> is handmade by him that's why he knows so much about this scale. yeah <laughs> oh, so every single scale that comes out of adapt goes through your hands uh it goes through us we do have a couple of people that work with us because the company uh, got bigger uh, we don't want to go too big so i think this is our limit um, and from here we have uh, i think we have four people working together with us on making and producing the boots because otherwise we do me and olga do everything ourselves so we do the social media we do uh, the shipment so Probably the customers that bought the debt, they know I sometimes write a personal uh, inscription uh, or something. To Shame on you, sometimes? <laughs> sometimes. Oh, come no, on. Every time you buy one, you actually get a card which is hand signed by myself and Olga. Uh, but sometimes I write on something uh, a bit awesome. extra, so okay. it's uh, fun. The other thing about uh, the Levy Skate is the new skin material. Um, basically, it is a vegan material. Um, and we always had the vegan skate from the beginning. Um, we did have, I, I wasn't really 100% happy with the material um, because when you fall on it, it was strong, but the look of it, the first layer would degrade uh, faster than I wanted it uh, to be. So this material is actually closer to the Nubok, like the, the leather version we have. It's about 70% of the strength of the Nubok, but the Nubok is like, top it's the, the strongest leather in the world. And these, um, these still have, sorry about... Just going out of it. Do you still have the the full leather skate? Is that always? Uh, yeah, the new book is, is full the leather. Stealth. That, yeah. The stealth is, is all leather. And, yeah, and it's specially made for us, this leather, also in Holland. So yeah, nobody else has this leather, basically. Um, this leather, fake leather, comes from Italy. Uh, fake leather. Fake is leather. Is there any animal called fake, Bernie? Fake. <laughs> Well, yeah, so this comes from Italy um, and it's really durable. So Levi had a pair he tested for one year. And I don't know if you have seen Levi skate, but he skates everything, every condition. He lives by the ocean, goes swimming with those things. So basically it's been tested so all year round. Uh, the next guy is going to be in Torp. He's going to win the Olympics. With the yeah, sure, why not? Why not? You have to adapt, you know? <laughs> Um, so it's a really strong uh, skin material, so I think people that love the look of the uh, vegan model, mm -hmm. they will be really pleased with it. Also it has a different feel to it because of the Diolan shell um, and the material is a bit more softer. So if you're not that hardcore into how you want your skate to set up, like this one is the one for you. Okay, basically. so let me ask you something. If someone wants to get uh, the stuffed skate but mm -hmm. a little bit softer, can they have a custom made yeah, of yeah. the of the yes. levy shell yeah. with the full leather. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We we do. We actually when we go through the process, uh, if you order direct, which is necessary with the aggressive skate, we go through a process of probably ten to fifteen emails back and forth just to make sure when you have the skate, it's a skate it's that cool. is right for you. That's awesome. So sometimes people would ask me, "What do you think? Uh, what we need?" and then. We give some advice on this shell would be better for you and uh, yeah this skin would be suitable for you that's cool and so, the salt plate what's this yeah salt plate is our own material i've been um, trying to get the material but he says it's a super <laughs> high secret <coughs> yeah. it's also produced in holland um so yeah we, we have been working with this material or types of versions of this material because we always try to up it a bit um so this year we got, no, last year we got this material and it's really fast. It doesn't uh, stretch as much as normal nylons do or uh, HMWs or whatever. Um, so yeah, it's, a, it's a, our own mixture basically and it's all CNC machined. That's why some people ask me why is the price the price it is. What's the price on this? Uh, sole plates are 60 euros. Uh, to be honest, if we wouldn't have made them in-house, they should be 100 to 200 euros. Okay, so it's so 60 and the frame? The frame is 80 euros. Yeah. Okay, so it's 140 to make your Solomon <coughs> school. Yeah, yeah, that's right. So uh, <laughs> put in the code, uh, we love Solomon, and you get 10% on the new Solomon uh, if Solomon. they come out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, but it's that's something I think it's really important that people should know is all the parts are really expensive to produce 
I got lucky because I work for a manufacturer that makes really high-end skates, ice they, skates. They have access to all those tools. We actually got a machine from them because I work there to produce all our stuff. Uh, if you would produce this, it's not possible for this price. Can, can I ask you just for a frame, just for a, a frame from one of those frames? Yeah. The, the, the one. So these frames are old, machined from a, a from one block, block. Yeah. one block of these. Yeah. Yeah. And the frame actually that's new on the Levy as well, uh, so it can fit up to 65 millimeter. But we didn't change any dimensions, so it's still the 60 frame everybody loved. Uh, we didn't change the dimensions, we only went more inwards the boot. Um, so the 65 almost feels like rolling with the 60s, only you get more speed with it. And what wheels do you have 65s? Um, it's a Symmetrix wheel, so our own sister company from Adept. So basically Symmetrix is all the hardware. Uh, Symmetrix is a no bullshit, uh, we don't do over branding, nothing. We, like even on the sole plates and frames there is no brand on it. Uh, but that's symmetrics. It's just like more in race car industries. We just like it clean. It has to perform. That's it. Um, so that's the idea behind uh, symmetrics. Same. But with if the, you really want, you can still write your name because these channels are inside. So whatever you write here, it's not gonna grind it. So you can. You still can write, be creative. I'm good. I, yeah, whatever you want. Whatever blamed God. <laughs> if you, <laughs> You can do whatever you want. Whatever. You go everywhere. <laughs> bearings on this frame? Uh, the bearings uh, are the standard symmetric, so it's a ABEX 7, okay. but it's a German uh, uh, quality made bearing. Okay. And what price are we talking for this? Um, the complete boot, I think it's... Complete boot or complete skate? Uh, oh, so the boot is... 370? No, no, that's a Stealth. That's the most expensive one uh, as aggressive. This one is 340 euros as the boot, which Levy gets a part of. of That's course. what I was going to say. It's cool because when you buy a skate like these, you're supporting a pro skater. Yeah, so. indeed. So yeah, they, they get trips from us and uh, like they can go. Uh, Levy went for this, he went to the States. The first time he ever went to the States. So, uh, and he, he filmed too. content for all of us. So yeah. So. So it's uh, yeah, pretty cool. And, okay. Uh, he likes to skate. He has a special. I like the thunderbolt. Thunder. Yeah, uh, yeah, and he has the one over here, uh, like a small thunderbolt here as well. It's cool. I like the the little detail here yeah. where the lace is going between. Yeah. And that's it. We know the price of that. And well, if it's a complete skate, would it? What would be the price of this? I think it's four hundred seventy. I have no idea. You get a, if you get a complete, you get a bit discount on the parts. Okay. Um, so, that's it. But, but you they, can, they can go to the website, which yeah. is adapt slash brand dot com. Adapt brand or adapt slash brand? No, not slash. Just okay. adapt brand. Adapt com. Com. Yeah. Okay, and that's it. You read it from the adapt man itself. Yeah. <laughs> himself, <laughs> and that's it. If you like the video, do not forget to give us some thumbs up. Thumbs down if you didn't like it. Let us know what you didn't like in case you didn't. And if you want to give Peter any feedback about this skate, drop a comment. I'm sure he's going to be reading the comments and. Maybe he's going to reply to you. You never know. If you don't try, you never know. <laughs> <laughs> Internet beef again. <laughs> Other than that, just <clears throat> don't forget why we all started skating. Because it's fun. Cheers. All right. <laughs> it's good. Done.